happening now? Yeah, and that weather still continues there on the south shore of Lake Tahoe, getting them rain, even though the lightning's moved on, still rather wet. 73 degrees currently in Sacramento with gray skies and a few sprinkles here and there. Southerly wind blowing at seven miles per hour. Currently in Stockton, also plenty of cloud cover right now. We have 79 degrees with a northwest wind blowing at 15 miles per hour. And these clouds do stretch a little bit farther south and through Stanislaus County. Towards Modesto, where currently we have conditions of 85 degrees, so a little bit warmer, not quite as cool. Northwest wind blowing at 17 miles per hour, so it's a bit breezy there in Modesto. How about Fairfield? Currently 73 degrees, and typically we have a nice breeze blowing, but look at the southwest wind, only 15 miles per hour. Again, lots of cloud cover in there. Are a few sprinkles here and there through Solano County. As we take a look at Lake Tahoe, this is where the activity was around Lake Tahoe. We had just a heavy, heavy downpour, lots of lightning. It was very stormy along the east shore of Lake Tahoe as well as the south and north shores. We had 58 degrees. Southerly winds currently blowing at 10 miles per hour. So what's uh, going on with our conditions? Well, taking a look at Doppler, you can see we still have a few lightning strikes up in through uh, Lassen County, also in through Nevada. Mainly just rain now in through our forecast area with a few smatterings of drops in through Sacramento County as well as Yolo County, Solano County, getting just some very light rain. This is not going to be, um, I don't expect to have much of any measurable rainfall from it, but yeah, you're going to be out and about. You may get uh, a little bit of that rain. I don't think it's going to make the roads all that slick, but Cameron Park starting to get some of the rain, the leading edge as it spills down from those thunderstorms in the Sierra. We're also seeing that through Placerville and Pollock Pines. You can see where it's been a little bit heavier near Truckee. That's starting to ease up a bit. Conditions are going to stay wet, though, in this locale as this band of moisture slowly starts to pull itself a little farther north and then off to the north and to the east. So future cast gives us an idea of what we can expect with that. As we go through tonight, cloud cover, it's going to stick with us, but it's slowly going to start moving farther north. As we go through Monday morning, we'll have those clearing skies. By noontime, there still is a chance for some buildup over the Sierra and maybe an isolated thunderstorm or shower, but it's not going to be anything like we've experienced the past couple of days. Expect to have more... Thunderstorms popping up there for your Tuesday. Beyond that, looking much drier and much warmer as we head past Wednesday, especially into Thursday and Friday. Temperatures, not too bad. Mid to upper 70s, your truck in Lake Tahoe, 79 degrees in Pollock Pines, Quincy 84 degrees, 82 in Grass Valley, 86 in Auburn, 87 degrees in Jackson. With cloud cover on the decrease, we'll see some sunshine through uh, San Francisco, 79 in Concord, 81 degrees in Fairfield, but we will have some early morning cloud cover, but that should decrease through the day. 88 in Stockton, 89 in Manteca, and temperatures staying in the 80s through Sacramento, as well as Folsom and Woodland, but 91 degrees in Maryville. Seven day forecast shows temperatures staying. Below normal through Wednesday. We started warming up though Thursday and Friday with temperatures climbing in the mid to upper 90s, Richard.